you know, calling out with a footstool. And right now we got El Glug versus. Uh, let me see. David? Does that say David or is that a Q? D Cubid? I don't know. Uh, but Joker versus Roy. JMX, you got info for us? Oh, Warchief, you got info for us? <laughs> How do you pronounce D Cubid? I'm just going DQ. Let's call him DQ, yeah. Um, but yeah, yeah, DQ uh, <laughs> winning Neutral a few times and, and pushing Joker to 69%. Arsene now on the on the field. All right, pop and roll with the dash tag, Glug. Tried wow. to get the counter on the upbeat poking above the ledge, but DQ timed it very well. Reaction uh, tech chase with the up air, covering multiple wow. options, and that's a Roy off stage. No counter from that. Ooh. I like the mix of going for the empty, la uh, empty land, land dash grab. Yeah, rolled past his pressure, classic ultimate. A lot of the time when you see someone trying to land uh, with a with a bear on your shield, you can roll past their pressure and get the punish on their landing. Yeah, and with that, he got a jab back yeah. and lets him close the stock in. Yep, that was very well done from DQ. Wow, what is, look at these the running F4. forward tilts covering yeah. the um, anti-option trying to run away or jump. Very reactive uh, landing catches from DQ. But right now he's trying to bait on the option with his dashes. Well, right outside the range of the dash tattoo, the Cuban is positioning himself really well around Glug's pressure. Yeah, went for the hard read on the F tilt. Yeah, DQ is uh, running away with this lead a little bit. Yeah, he's playing incredibly well. He's very conscious of Glug's burst, and that's going to be it. Yeah, it's important too, especially against Joker and uh, even Joker without Arsene having yeah. really great combos. Dash tag, dash grab—they're incredibly good, so you always have to be ready. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And DQ is. Positioning himself. Wow. Was, that was a really catch. good to yeah. What a catch. Okay, Glug positioned himself. Mispositioned himself a little bit with, uh, with his jump there. And DQ just got the roll up up tilt there that he needed. Wow. <laughs> Both of them trading uh, blows onto their shield, but no big punish off of, uh, off of that interaction. All right. It looks yeah. like uh, Glug's just trying to burst in and get the air to air nair there. Yeah. Glug's, uh, rec Glug's recognizing that uh, DQ is looking for like the nair. He's, he's looking to beat him in the air to air with his disjoint, so Glug's jumping a lot less up close now. He's only trying to jump from like a spot where either he's either DQ's done with his nair or he doesn't think he's going to jump in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, I went for the roll read again, but it was slightly too far away. Caught the roll with the down smash and Glug bringing it to a last stop situation, but still a little bit rough. Uh, DQ opting instead of uh, waiting out, Arsene just uh, going to swing at Joker and, and break it off him himself. Okay, let's trap situation. Isn't able to get the neutral get up call with the nair that he wanted. Uh, good on Glug to not get too anti there and uh, give Roy what he wants. Right. Um, especially towards the ledge. I mean, side B Jair can definitely yeah, just take your stock it's there. It's very scary, especially on neutral get up. Glug, he is mixing up the timing of his get ups though, so not only like he's, he's making DQ doubt a little bit exactly what he's going to do. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this is definitely doable for Glug. I mean, 50% on the Arsene meter. Oh, both players playing very careful. DQ doesn't want to throw the lead, and Glug also doesn't want to die. So they're playing very... Um, they're trying not to jump into each other's range too much. Yeah. Uh, Glug in, opting instead of drifting in with the jumps, he's just jumping in place, waiting for David to commit or DQ to, to commit to a burst option. But the four tilt's going to take it there. Able to catch him out of the startup of a jump there. Yeah, very, very good stuff from DQ. Played it very well um, throughout the entire match, especially the first stop. He was very, very quick with catching his, uh, catching his landings on reaction. Mm -hmm. um, Glug tried mixing up with his drifts, but DQ wouldn't fall for like. So what happens is a lot of the time, players will drift longer than usual in the air and then that'll cause their opponent to swing early and then the player can land but DQ wasn't falling for that at all like yeah. he, he was just reactive the whole time like, you're gonna take your time I'm gonna take my time go ahead <laughs> uh, back to stadium two Glug opting to play I, I it makes sense for, uh, why he's playing in the corner he's waiting for DQ to commit to a burst option yeah. um, whether that be drift in with an uh, aerial or just dash in. Right. And it's not even like, it, it, he, he's waiting for it as well, but he's also just like playing around it too. Exactly. He yeah. doesn't want to like, he doesn't want to put himself in a spot where he can't react to it. A little bit too slow on the dash grab there. If he had time to bear maybe a little bit later, he might have been able to get grab afterwards. But Glog, he's playing a little bit 
further outside his disjoint range now. Oh, wow. Yeah. Called the drift there from DQ. Oh, and no jump and not going a little too low with the uppie. Yeah, there I think he might have just, yeah, just no jump, you're right. Oh, wow. Yeah, good tech. And, and the patience from Claude, too. How hard is that move to two frame? I mean, um, it's two frameable. It is Cons pretty decently consistently. Like it, it's definitely oh, a big threat wow. for Joker. But with Roy though, his two frame tools aren't great. Uh -huh. um, his down tilt's all right, but it, it'll never kill, right? It's yeah. just like it's just pressure and damage, pressure and damage. Yeah, I mean it's good, especially with Arsene out. Yeah, um, you the more you hit Arsene, Arsene goes away faster. So when it comes to Roy killing Arsene, he might want to like grab ledge dare or oh, just okay, dare okay. the ledge. Like uh -huh. it's about as as good as he can get. Maybe bear on techable at high percent. Mm -hmm. Can be able to hit him out of his double jump there. Yeah, he's he's covering the roll read. Yeah, for the hard, hard roll read there, but Glug didn't give it to him. He's able to reset neutral off of it. Four kill. Glug might have been looking for a dash or a roll there, but uh, David gave him, or DQ gave him the uh, the F-tilt instead. Caught him out of the attempted read. And yeah, using, wow, weak Nair into grab and getting an open up from it. Tried to get the falling upper on the whiff punish from the dash attack, but a little bit too far away. But I, a hella respected attempt. That's very good uh, awareness from DQ. Staying a little bit too far away, though. Yo, dash, yeah, dashing away, recognizing that Glug was looking to throw out some buttons. Positioning himself very well around Joker's hitboxes. Oh, wow. And covering the jump with a back air and Glug uh, taking the lead. Very good catch from Glug after the... Uh, the neutral be recognizing wow. that a lot of players like to jump after that to try to get back on stage early. Glog was able to cover it very well. A little bit too slow on the on the lane catch with the bear. Uh, not right. being a strong bear, just sending Joker off stage, but Glog wasn't able to get the reaction on the roll that he wanted. Now back to neutral. Glog, excellent spacing on the nair, but mm -hmm. got his down tilt caught afterwards. We Forder being able to take it off the stage. Very clutch, very clutch. Oh yeah, reading one of the drift ends with a grab and no open up, but still stage control. Go. Glog right now in the driver's seat, zoning him out with the side Bs. Didn't get the Ooh, punish wow. that he wanted on the, on the dash track as Joker just ducked a little bit under it. Yeah, recognizes the back there was negative on hit there, so he just got the grab. He finally called out the air dodge. A lot of people like to air dodge off of throw yeah. combos and getting a punish off of it, sending DQ into the corner, but DQ fighting his way back to center stage. Glog is positioning himself very well at ledge to avoid getting uh, reversaled off the ledge in case he misses his read. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah both of them just calling out drift in and air dodge with grab. Uh, these run-up shields are really, uh, really good for uh, DQ here. Oh, Glug looked for the roll read, but it was a little bit too fast. He did have the right idea. Caught the landing with the dash attack. Is he going to be able to take the stock? Oh, maybe should have went for down guns there with no jump, but uh, now it's uh -oh. DQ with the uh, ledge trapping. Oh, excuse me. Roy can neutral be his uh, his up B2. That's, that's his best two Oh, frame. he can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. True, excuse true, me. true. Sorry about that. This is very, this is dead even. This is very tense, yeah. yeah. Dead even. And Roy, of course, especially on the ledge, can make anything happen at this percent. But Glug, get him out of his jump with the guns. Missed the second gun. Ooh, that could have been dangerous, but four yeah. tilt, is that going to be enough? Not, Not quite, quite yet. But this could be an edge guard. Oh, but missing but the ledge just a little bit little there. Bit. He might have been a little bit too far away, or he might have done the up beat early to avoid an edge guard. And this is going to be our first game three? Yeah. yeah. Very well played from both players. Mm -hmm. um, Good adaptation to uh, jump in, be more comfortable in his space in the corner, and waiting for Roy's burst option. Absolutely, yeah. He's, he's a lot more patient and... Uh, not campy, but he's drifting back on a lot of his aerials, positioning himself a lot safer mm -hmm. to avoid. Rever he's prioritizing avoiding aver reversals and hits rather than just going for consistent like damage, 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 damage. Yeah, he's very conscious of his Glug's very conscious of his positioning against uh, against DQ, mm -hmm. and Glug's going to be switching to his, his patented patented DK. Yeah, oh, he plays DK. Yes, very wow, very consistently. He's oh, I'm the, excited. One of, the, one of the better DKs in, oh, in this wow. region. Cheese Master, yeah, he probably banned like so and so, so and so, and the guy's like, yeah, I'll go smash. He's like, okay, Donkey Kong. <laughs> <laughs> um, Roy having really great combos on DK, but Glug just not giving him the opportunity to get an open up. He absolutely needed to cross up that nair, or else that would have been shield grabbing to death right there. <laughs> yeah, no, th yeah. Um, this is like ding dong percent, no? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, just going off stage with the throw. There, you're just dead. 
Wow, yep. Roy's recovery. Yep. Just not being able to make it from that deep. A lot of characters can't make it from there. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a very <laughs> yeah. scary situation to be in. Wow, yep. the neutral be armoring through and David's off stage. Oh my glug. Oh wow, this yep. is just Got the double so jump dominant. The that's another stock. Glug up three stocks to one here, game three. Glug just, man, making this man's stocks disappear. Yeah, he's in a very comfortable spot. Tried to armor through the jab, but DQ timed it well. Uh, DQ can definitely, definitely bring this back. Oh, absolutely. This yeah, DK Roy. in disadvantage is not not a great yeah. character. You so. can suffocate him, kill him early too. Yeah. Oh, caught the double jump. He just has to really. He has to avoid shield grab at the ledge. Shield grab under the platform. Oh wow. Yeah, and this is the, where DK struggles in disadvantage. Good weight on the juggle there too from DQ. Ooh, got the trip. Oh no. Tech chase. Oh, with the uppy, is that gonna be it? That was. That was really Almost. Cool. That was really dope. <laughs> that yeah, was that such was. A good setup. He like held him. He's like, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? And then he down through DI mix up, because that doesn't usually tech chase the DI up. Uh-huh. Alright, let's see. DQ is able to take the stock on the ledge here. Okay. Able to get the, the neutral get up catch with the uh with the Nair. Oh, oh the Duncan! <laughs> yeah, Glug with the counter the DK counter pick on Smashville is able to uh, able to do able it. Able to seal that out. 2-1. Commit 